June 2nd, Pastor is saying to us, the deity of Christ. Our opening scripture comes from the book of John, chapter 5, verse 18. Therefore, the Jews sought the more to kill him, because he not only had broken the Sabbath, but said also that God was his father, making himself equal with God. Until you discover who Jesus really is, you can't walk with him. Jesus is Adonai. He's the Lord God. The very thought of this blows the mind. No wonder the Jews had difficulty accepting him. They accused him of making himself equal with God because he said God was his father. They knew that when someone says, God is my father, it doesn't mean God gave birth to that person because God is a spirit. They understood what Jesus was saying. He himself was Jehovah in human manifestation. In John chapter 10, verse 30, he made another staggering declaration that made them angrier. He said, I and my father are one. In other words, we are one and the same. If you've seen me, you've seen the father. Now the Jews got really crazy and they took up stones again to stone him. But Jesus interrupted them and asked, Many good works have I showed you from my father. For which of those works do you stone me? They replied, For a good work we stone thee not, but for blasphemy, because that thou, being a man, makest thyself God. John chapter 10, verses 32 to 33. Notice the two charges brought against Jesus. The first one was blasphemy for saying God was his father. The second was robbery, because being a man, he made himself God. He was therefore condemned with robbers. But the Bible says in Philippians chapter 2, verses 5 to 6, Let this mind be in you, which was also in Christ Jesus, who, being in the form of God, thought it not robbery to be equal with God. This verse was a direct response to the Jewish charge against Jesus that he was a thief for declaring himself to be equal with God. Jesus didn't think he was robbing God by being equal with God, because he was in the form of God. The Greek word for form is morphe, which means nature. In other words, he was in the very nature or essence of God, though he looked like a man. He was in the form of God. In essence, Jesus is God. This is one of the cleverest communications in the New Testament about the deity of Jesus Christ. His claim to deity is right. Please say this prayer with me. Lord Jesus, you're the great God of glory and the complete embodiment of deity. Thank you for revealing your divine personality to me. I celebrate your lordship and rulership over my life and over all of creation. You are the most high God, and you alone are worthy of all praise, worship, and adoration. Amen. For further study, please read Titus chapter 2, verse 13 of the Passion Translation, 1 Timothy chapter 3, verse 16, Colossians chapter 1, verses 15 to 19, and Colossians chapter 2, verse 9. For the one-year Bible reading plan, please read John chapter 17, verses 1 to 26, and 1 Chronicles chapters 9 to 10. For the two-year Bible reading plan, please read 1 Corinthians chapter 15, verses 11 to 19, and Proverbs chapter 29. Rhapsody of reality.